I feel really good about what that was with Daisy. I'm very excited for this next conversation with Kelsey. She has this brightness about her, this light that's different. And uh, I'm very excited for you all to meet her. So I'm going to go grab Kelsey, and I'll be right back. Okay. Sounds good. I'm excited to see Kelsey today. Every time I leave Kelsey, I just miss her. I feel so much better when she's there. I am positive that my family today will see when I walk in with Kelsey how much she brings a different side of me. Hi. Hello. <gasps> Miss Hi. This means a lot to me to see if she fits in, to see if she's comfortable. You doing good? <gasps> yeah. Good. That was a good one. If breath. she can have the same level of confidence that I have. I think it's all hitting mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. <gasps> it's all good. How are you feeling? I'm excited, I'm nervous, mm -hmm. all the emotions. I know how important these people are to you, mm -hmm. so. They're gonna love you. I have zero doubts about that. Uh, it's just gonna be a special day. I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna be there with you. I do feel the weight of like how significant this is, meeting his family, all the people that are gonna be there today. Like all their thoughts and opinions do matter. And so it's just, it's a little intimidating. I really hope it's a positive thing and everyone loves me and appreciates me. <laughs> but I'm not the only one that's meeting his family and I know how amazing Daisy is and that is really scary to think of that we're gonna kind of be compared to each other. Hi everyone. Hi guys. Hey. I think we should tell you a little bit about how we got here today. Um, do you want to start talking about, like, night one? Yeah, so I was in the limo and I was very calm. I was like, this is, you know, just a, a, a guy that I'm going to meet and I'm going to see, like, how, you know, we work together. Then I walked out the limo and I saw him and I was like, oh my gosh, I can't speak. <laughs> and my mind went, like, blank. Um, I don't really know exactly what I said, but I had a voodoo doll. She had a voodoo doll of me. <laughs> oh, no. But she was very sweet. She took the voodoo doll, she kissed it on the cheek and said, did you feel that? And, and then oh, handed it to me. And I had that moment that day I was looking at it. I was like, oh, I like her a lot. We had um, a one-on-one -on -one in Ronda, Spain. He swept me away on a little Vespa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she called her Lizzie McGuire moment. Yeah, and <laughs> he was like, no, it's my Lizzie McGuire moment. <laughs> I thought that was so fun. That's so good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And that was so magical. We had we ran around Rhonda and put together a little picnic, and um, I got to tell Joey a little bit more about my family. Mm -hmm. um, I lost my mom a couple years ago, and like that's been very like a significant part of my life. My mom meant so much to me. I know that she would love Joey. Um, he's got like the best heart and. I got to also tell him about, you know, my parents' relationship and how my dad took care of my mom until the very end, mm -hmm. you know, um, doing everything he could for her. And, like, that's what I'm looking for in a partner. I feel so lucky that I've gotten an opportunity to get to know her so well. I'm hoping you get to see what I've seen and, and get a clear picture of why I feel so strongly about where we're at. The emotional connection the two of them had was very obvious right from the get-go. Kelsey, you want to come chat with Ellie and I? Yes. Kelsey is very bright, has an emotional intelligence, but is Kelsey the one for the long haul? Is she ready for this to be a relationship that ends in engagement? Hi. Hi. How's it going? It's going good. I was really nervous at first, and I feel like I just was like so much energy. <laughs> but I'm excited to sit down with y'all and like express how much Joey means to me, and you know, y'all to ask me all the hard questions you want. What do you feel like makes the two of you compatible? I don't know. I think that I've been saying this. I feel like throughout, and like things just make sense together. Like we can just joke and be lighthearted, but also have really serious conversations. I think that we're on the same level about a lot of things. Um, I know that I love Joey because I know the way that like, I want to make him feel. Like I know that I want him to feel loved and I want him to feel special. And I don't know, I just, I want to choose him, you know? And I think that that's just why I feel like we could work is because I want to choose him every day. Yeah. yeah. I hope you can see that he just feels so deeply and goes all in. When he gets engaged, he wants that to be his forever person. Do you 
like feel ready to be married? Like, how does that, how does that like, how does that thought make yeah. you feel? You know I don't, I mean? Yeah, I don't think it's something that I'm like, I need to be married, you know? I don't think that it's like a thing that I'm like, I, you know, I came into this being like, I need to get married, you know? Like, I'm like not on any timeline per se, like, you know, when that is right for me, but it's like, I guess the person that makes sense with me. If he were to propose to you, would, are you ready for that? Um, I think so, yeah. 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 Kelsey is amazing, but she wasn't able to give the same response that Daisy was in saying that she was 100% ready. Probably one of Joey's biggest fears is that he chooses to propose to someone who's not ready to accept that proposal. My sister and I and my family would hate for that to happen to him again. How do you feel about her in general after talking to her and getting to know her more? Um, I thought our conversation mm -hmm. went really Great. well. Um, she was amazing. Mm -hmm. Definitely a lot more energy. Mm -hmm. um, silly. Very silly. Fun. Um, just like a bright light. Like she lit up the room when she walked in and you guys obviously felt very comfortable together. Mm -hmm. I mean, off of that too, has she expressed that she wants to marry you? I, I, I haven't I haven't taken too many steps ahead because I think that's a conversation to happen now. Okay. Um, Daisy had kind of told us without us asking too much that she was like, I'm all in this. If Joey gets down on one knee, I'm in it. If you propose today, 100% yes. Yeah. When we asked Kelsey, she said, I think so, and I and I think she said it in that way because I think she was really nervous when she was talking to us. That's good to know, though, because I, I do feel like Daisy is there. I don't have doubts, but this week makes it real, and it's just a reconfirmation of can you truthfully see yeah. yourself being with me because I don't want to have any yeah. doubts. Yeah. My sister pointed out something with Kelsey that she said, yes, I think so. Like, that's scary to hear that. It's not that I don't understand why you would say, yes, I think so at this moment, but it does get me a little scared if there's an infatuation that's not anything deeper. I need to talk to Kelsey more about that answer because it is my biggest fear. I see how you look at him, and and I'm so happy to see that. Do you think this is just an infatuation? Do you no. really feel this is something you want for a future? Yes. I told him that I loved him, and it's not just the way that he makes me feel, but it's the way that I want to make him feel. I want him to, you know, feel confident in us and feel loved and feel appreciated. And I know outside of this, it's not all butterflies and rainbows. And I want to, you know, like get through the difficult times with him and figure that out. Yeah. So I, this question I don't want to ask, but you know, putting yourself in a position because the reality is you are one of two women. What if Joe, my son, decides that you know you're, you know, you aren't. That yeah. woman, what, how do you, how would you feel doing that? Um, <laughs> so, yeah, no, it's, know, okay, no, it's okay. That's it's why a reality of it all. <sighs> Daisy is an amazing woman. I love her so much. And I think it's hard to think about, you know, either my heart getting broken or one of my good friends. But, you know, on the other side of things, like, I don't know. I think that it's gonna be really difficult for sure because I can see things so clearly with Joey. I think like, oh, what do they think? Like, what? who do they see? You know, maybe they would think that, you know, Daisy and him would be a better match. I could see them definitely swaying to one side or another. I mean, you could be the one. Mm -hmm. You could be my future daughter. I know. Or you could get your heart broken. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Are you prepared for either both of those? Yeah, I think that it's hard to think about um, because I want this so bad, but also I do have like this peace I feel like in my heart that I know that if it's not me, like I know he's gonna be really happy with things, you know? But then I also think about like how much like I could see it being us and I get right. so happy. Right. And <laughs> so it just like, yeah, I totally could see it being us, but also it could not. But you know, we had, I remember Joey's hometown. And he looked at me and said, I'm, I'm the one. I know I'm the one. But if I'm not, that means that Charity, who I care for so greatly, has found someone that she connects with more. And I will be happy for her because that's how I feel about Charity. I care for her that much that if it's not me, it means that she's found her forever. But 
whoever he chooses could very well be you. Mm -hmm. The way you look at him is special. Thank you. That's a lot. And it's like, I can't tell you how much he means to me. But he is very special and um, he has just the heart of gold. <laughs> There's that thought in the back of my mind that's like, why wouldn't Daisy and him make sense? Like, Daisy's so awesome. But I really hope that through my reaction, they can see how much I care about Joey and how much I can see it with him. Thank you so much. Kelsey cares so much for Joey, and she communicated that very clearly. I think he's going to have a challenge to try to figure out where his heart's leading him. So, how are you feeling? Someone asked me, you know, at the end of the day, like, it could not be me. And, like, I I know that Daisy is, is an amazing woman, and to uh, make me think of, like, you with somebody else, it's, like, it is just, like, a hard thing to think about, you know? Okay. I understand it. But I hope you just feel great about everything that can be, and I'll miss you, and I'm excited to see you next. Good. This is hard. I've been in her position. I know how much you start to picture it and what this ending can be. And then your brain immediately tells you to stop. See you later. I'll see ya. It was a very special day. But I can see both Daisy and Kelsey be a part of my family and it makes my decision really hard. I wish I knew more about what I was gonna do. I wish I could be clear right now. They only have a few days left before doing what's most important, which is making my decision and getting down on one knee. This is going to be a different level of weight that I'm gonna be feeling. I don't wanna mess this up. I want to make sure I'm doing everything in my power to ask the right questions because what these women deserve is me to be fully sure. Like, who can I really see it with? <laughs>